hey guys welcome back to our channel it's go funny lungu back with another reaction video if you're new welcome if you're not welcome back thank you for continuously supporting us uh thank you for subscribing watching liking commenting everything that you guys do never goes unnoticed we're very very grateful if you're new like i said my name is funny lungu feel free to suggest anything that you would love to see on this channel anything you want us to react to we we'll be more than glad just give us the name or the link down below and we'll check it out so today i'm going to be reacting to your deeds will not be accepted if you do this so without wasting time let's get into the video is a scary hadith but I need to mention it because we have young brothers and old brothers and we're all in need of guidance. The Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam mentions this hadith in the narrator's Tawban radiallahu anhu. The Rasul says, min ummati. I know people from my ummah, from the Muslims. يَأْتُونَ يَوْمَ الْقِيَامَةِ بِحَسَنَاتٍ they will come in the day of judgment with good deeds the size of mountains glowing bright so the rasul says and yet allah rabbul izza will make it disappear like husks of rice you know it just blows away in the wind all their deeds will disappear. So the Sahabi asks, Ya Rasul, describe them to us so we don't do what they do. So the Rasul said, Ama innahum min ikhwanikum. They are from your brothers. Wa min jildatikum. And from your tribesmen. And they're not ordinary Muslims. Wa ya'khudhuna min al-layli kama ta'khudhun. They are people who wake up in the middle of the night and pray as you pray. But what is the problem? But they are people when in seclusion, they transgress against the limits of Allah. Rabbul Think Muslim when he and she is alone in a room and there's a screen and a laptop and a computer and a phone they transgress against the limits and boundaries of Allah Rabbul the poem says it beautifully if my lord were to ask me did you have no shame from me did you have no shame in disobeying me? And you kept your sin hidden from my creation. And you came with your sins to me. You're afraid of a cat coming into your room, but you are not afraid that I was watching. So if your sin, listen to me Muslims, because I need to clarify this. If the sin in seclusion happens out of weakness and out of a slip and it is not jurra against Allah Rabbul Izza, that is an ordinary sin. But if you sin recognizing in a way that the Lord is watching and yet you still don't care and persist, then you have fallen in courage against Allah Rabbul Izza and then Allah will delete the deed. So my dear brothers, as was the condition of our predecessors, concentrate in my Allah Rabbul Izza grant me and you tawfiq. Not only on doing the deed and my Allah grant you the capacity to do a lot of khair, but concentrate on the deed being accepted after it is done and my Allah Rabbul Izza accept from me and from you. Uh, sometimes we really can't judge books by their covers what i say i use that because um if you meet me i feel like you'd think one thing that i'm not you know only those maybe people close to me can try to define what funny is but they still wouldn't define me as i would define myself 
at the end of the day there's many things that we do when we're alone when we're with certain people it depends but there's a lot of things that we indulge in um unknowingly unknowingly you know and there's people that do great things even behind closed doors and there's people that um west people like the west the west character comes out of them and the only people they can blame is themselves because they're letting that part of them come out um sometimes avoid being alone because you start thinking evil things sometimes just don't have too much idle time you know get a book read learn a course on your own you know do many things volunteer here and there there's so many things that one can do to change or take up the empty time or free time that um we can avoid many things that we indulge in there are people that are keyboard warriors the people that will bully you with their fake accounts and saying all sorts of things i think that's a good example you know and they're they're just i don't know but if you asked uh, the mother of that person to describe them they'll be described in such a way that you say no this can't be the same person that was bullying me on the internet or saying this or did this so it's um even though funny may not see what you're doing you may not see what funny is doing or my neighbor may not see what i'm doing there is that part that we all acknowledge those that at least believe in god that god sees everything that we do you know so despite the good that you're doing in this world god is still seeing the previous things that you're doing behind closed doors all those are going to uh, matter all those we should look into it's really up to us i think as long as you're aware of what's going on in life and how you feel like the world works then there's chance that you can correct yourself there's always time as long as you're alive today you're breathing today you're seeing this today you're praying today asking for forgiveness you have chance to turn around from that act that you want to do and do something more productive if that makes sense always look for things to do good things that is not bad things so let me know what you guys actually think about this video and what the hadith says do you believe it do you not do you just believe in if i pray i'm going to be forgiven so i can do whatever i want your thoughts are always welcome if there's anything you want me to react to let me know down below just give me the name or the link and i'll be sure to react to eat make sure to give this video a thumbs up share it to the friends and of course do not forget to subscribe and i'll see you in my next reaction video